Hello and welcome to Piano Shack with me, Woody. After editing hundreds of my own videos with performances and demonstrations of synthesizers and keyboards, I've realized my improvisations and chord progressions are beginning to get a little bit stale, often with the same tired old progressions and often in the key of C, like I demonstrated there at the beginning of the video. So I've decided to challenge myself and learn 200 new songs. And I've realized from the comments that a lot of you do respond very well to songs and tunes that you recognize. So I've decided to learn 200 new pop tunes, not just pop, but also soul, R&B, funk, and some jazz as well. So from this list, I'm gonna pick off the first three tunes today. We'll start alphabetically. So we'll start with some songs that I want to learn, uh, starting with the letter A, and hopefully, uh, you find this interesting and perhaps even want to join with me on this quest, in which case I'd be really thrilled if you wanted to play along with me and learn these songs together so we can make it a bit more of an interactive thing instead of me just learning these for myself. So let's get started and see how we get on. So I've got my little clipboard here and a Sharpie. I'm actually going to make notes here about the songs that we learn, because I have learned hundreds of songs over the years, obviously, but I forget which songs I've learned and obviously the key that they go in, the chords and so on. That's the most difficult thing when demonstrating a synthesizer is coming up with ideas and stuff to play. So I'm gonna make these notes and then we'll put them into a Filofax thingy that I bought here where I can sort everything alphabetically. I think that'll work out good. So let's take the first tune. Okay, this is the Steve Miller Band, Abra Cadabra. I've actually written here Abra Cadabra Cadabra, so a bit too many A's. But uh, let's see if we can, uh, by ear, hear what was going on there. Let's get the key. Okay, straight away. In the key of A minor. This is fairly easy, actually. I started with an easy song. And I have played this before in a band, but it was about 30 years ago, so I've pretty much forgotten everything. But uh, just a few chords, I think, on this song. Let's have a go. We've got the bass line. That's the groove. Let's move it down. Okay, so that's in A minor then. The key is A minor. I'll show you the cheat sheet at the end of the video here as we've figured out the song. So the intro is just A minor. It's just an A minor vamp. A minor vamp. See what happens next. Okay, so that's fun to play actually. <laughs> now let's keep the groove going. Just like that. That's the intro. I think that's pretty much the whole song once we figured that out and I think it's easy as well. So let's have a listen. There we go. Nice chord for you there. Remember how it goes. Okay, that's easy. The verse and the chorus are the same. So the chords are A minor and a D minor. I know I'm gonna get the Sharpie on the keys eventually here. It's a risk we're just gonna to have to take. And then we have this chord here. 
which is a super nice funky chord there. That is, I can't see the Synthesia screen, so I'm not sure what it's telling me, but that is a sharp nine chord, E7 sharp nine, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. E7 sharp nine. That's basically all the chords. If we jump back here, so there, you have the chords for Abracadabra. Let's move on. Bill Withers, Ain't No Sunshine. Huh, coincidence, also in A minor. Okay. <laughs> What's the groove? Okay. I think it was a strange chord in there. What's a what's a I heard something else. D minus seven. A sound. There's a chord there, it's a note I'm not quite uh, identifying. Keep it simple. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Passing chord there. Something along those lines, we've got the chords. I'll need to work a little bit on finding an arrangement on that one. But uh, there you go, it's the chords there. Okay, the next one I've really been dreading because it's in a nightmare of a key signature. It's in E or B or something like that. The chords are really, really tricky. I've never been able to play this very well or even remember the chords or anything, but uh, let's give it our best shot. 
Yeah, Africa by Toto, another one of the A's that we're learning today. We'll finish off with this one. Big challenge, it will be very challenging. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, find the notes. So it looks like we're in E to begin with. I think it changes key. A. E with the G sharp in the bass. Let's write this down because I will forget intro. We have A, we have transpose the keyboard, E over G sharp, E over G sharp, C sharp minor. I told you these chords are a nightmare because it's in a really tricky key signature. But that's the intro. I know I'm going to get uh, screwed for copyright claims on this particular video, but uh, maybe it's worth it. Let's go ahead. The chorus is a tricky one. I know, because I've tried to play this before, and I have succeeded, but I've forgotten. Okay, we're now in, the, in B. Okay, it starts with a B, B major. D sharp, see what I mean? D sharp minor. What were they thinking of these guys? D sharp minor. Or E flat minor if you prefer, but what is that? G sharp minor. Can you believe it? G sharp minor. Okay, same chord, but the bass moves. I'm doing this from memory. We'll just check in a minute. G sharp minor over F sharp in the bass. So that's where we've got so far. Sharp. G sharp minor, maybe seven. It's <laughs> such an awkward key signature. So that's the intro riff again. where we're at. This is fast as well. Go 
on to the uh, chorus. Ah, shit, I wrote that wrong. Just the verse. Chorus. I think the chorus is easy. I've got it in my memory, actually. Mm. So C sharp minor takes you into the chorus. Okay, now. <laughs> This is interesting. Uh, so we, what we have here is an F sharp minor, F sharp minor to D. So after that really hard verse, we've got an easy chorus to A to E, just like that. And I recognize this as being the uh, most widely used four pop chords progression of all time. This is the, what did the, uh, what was it called? The Axis of Awesome did the, these, a medley of all the songs that feature these chords. And there were hundreds of them. Here we've got a little turnaround. Just going up to the A. Sorry for the sloppy playing. And uh, in case you were curious, today's featured piano is Piano Tech. This, I think, is the New York Steinway D, just playing one of the vanilla presets. sharp minor at the end turn it around C sharp F sharp minor I'm running out of space E over G sharp uh, just about squeezed it in there and then we're back to the intro. So yeah, that's the chorus chords there, if I didn't show you it already. So yeah, that's three of the songs learned. Well, more or less, I've got some notes and roughly what the chords are. I will practice a little bit on those uh, off camera, I think, just to really nail them in my memory. But yes, that's three songs, 197 to go. But I feel quite chuffed that we learned three songs today. Uh, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed the format. I uh, hope it wasn't too tortuous watching me trying to figure out the chords by ear. But uh, yeah, I'd be thrilled if any of you wanted to join me on this quest. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you again soon. Cheerio.